hey guys welcome back to another video so as you see by the title below guys i'm just giving you like a little motivational speech maybe someone needs a little word of encouragement or something maybe you're trying to do something and it's not working out and you feel like giving up and all of that but anyways guys please remember to like this video leave a, leave a thumbs up on this video turn your post notification bell on all right so let me start by saying like god give us stress and yes, I said that God give us stress because God give us stress in order to see how strong we are. Alright, for example, a lot of times you want to do something. You start to do it, you feel the passion about it. And you're saying, yes, you reach 50%. You say, yes, I'm getting this, I'm getting there and all of that, right? When you reach 70%, things start like crumbling and all of that so you start giving up you start thinking negative you don't want to bother do it so like that was your dream so you not because of one stress changing your ability changing your thoughts towards your dream your dream crash instead of guys you're supposed to push forward right push forward after every stressful day, remember that God give you a hundred percent pass. All right, God give us stress in order to make us firm, to let us feel as if you know, for bill us. All right. For example, I'm going to give you a great, great example. All right. You want to grow a watermelon, right? So, in order to grow the watermelon, or anything farm of tree you want to grow a tree but if you get the seed and you throw the seed on seed on the concrete the sun is just gonna burn it but if you get the seed and you dig a hole and put that seed inside of the hole even and put, cover it with the dirt eventually it will grow so God give us dirt we all been through dirt Everybody, man give us dirt, woman give us dirt, people are, there's going to be a time where people are going to come and talk, all of that, but without the dirt, you can't grow, right, you can't grow without the dirt, so you have to organize your life, you can't give up, right, you got to dig that hole to put the seed in, you got to cover that seed with dirt, Right? In order for it to grow. People gonna say you do this, people gonna say you do that, people gonna say the most negative stuffs about you in order for you to crush your dreams. Right? I don't know why the door make lines, but guys, I'm sorry about that. So this is just a motivational speech to say get up and do what you got to do never give up push go for it no matter when the body i go on so the giant girl eh, and the boy they did a did a bad man and the girl they did a this and all of that they're all going to come and say whatever but listen if you go into like you're going to a plant store, I don't know what I'm, if a garden store or whatever they call it, right? And they want to plant an apple tree. They're going to take up the soil. They're going to take up the soil in order to plant the apple tree. Right? So listen, you see the negative stuff what people say about you is the soil. Soil of nutrition. Remember that. Soil of nutrition. You can do this. You can. Yes. Soil make your bloom. I remember. Once there is a tree. There, once there is a tree. There is going to be a blossom. No matter how long it takes. 
It's just that you can't give up. All right. God give us stress in order to achieve our dreams. All right. So no matter what the world want to push at or what the world want to come with, never give up. That soil is to give you nutrients in order to grow, to become stronger and a better person. All right, guys. So I just want anybody who's feeling down or you're feeling out and you feel like you can't make it and it's not going to work, trust me, it is going to work. Just believe in God. No matter what you do, believe in God. Pray about it. Bend on your knees and pray. I'm not a Christian, but I believe in God. Anything I pray for, I'm going to get it. So just believe in God. Anywhere in the life you're going, you're going to meet obstacles. It's just how you deal with it. When you're going after your dream, me could have reached my dream long time. But only if I realized how wonderful God was. Because, I mean, I wanted to be, um, I wanted to be a soldier, right? I apply for the army six times as I leave high school. And that was like my dream from way back. I wanted to be a soldier. I want to be a soldier. I want to be a soldier. I want to be a soldier. I you know. I applied for the army six times. And I didn't get through. I didn't get through. In which I shouldn't have given up. I should have get up. Maybe got to camp. Cause you know, we did normally. When in my days, you did have to do it online. You have to send an application online. Right? And I applied six times and I didn't get through. And all I did have to do was get up off my ass and go to camp and do what I got to do. But instead of that, I look elsewhere. So I crashed my dreams. Right now it's too late. I can't go back in the army more. I've tattooed on this and that. But I have another dream where I'm working towards. So no matter what people are going to say to me or whatever. Nothing cannot disencourage me. Nothing. And it's sad to say you're never too old to learn. Okay? You're never too old to learn. But it is what it is. Guys, never give up on your dream. If you want to be the best YouTuber, you will. If you want to be the next top model, you will. If you want anything at all you want to be, you will. Just do what you got to do. Don't give up. Remember, the dirt is the soil, and the soil gives you nutri nutrient, nutrition, nutrient, whatever. Yes, so you got to do what you got to do. Use the soil to motivate you. Use the soil to push you forward. Use that soil, and the soil is things that people's gonna say. People gonna say, people's gonna talk about your past, what you did in your past, and all of that. The past doesn't matter. What matter is now? What you can do now? All right. So yes, guys. Please remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Turn your post notification bell on. If you enjoy this motivational speech, please comment down below. I'm out.